Hi students, I am Siano Jalota. This video is all about the regular course of SCMP which you all can enroll through the Google Drive or through our Agenext app whether Android or iOS. What does a student look forward when he takes the virtual lectures? What does he look forward? First, so the content that you all will be providing. So therefore in this video I will be sharing the five books that we all offer the most exhaustive content of SCMP. So therefore, like, you know, even in exams, if something new comes, you are well aware of that and you will be capable of answering that. That is first. Second, I'll be providing what options you all have as regarding the fees. Third, our past track record. Fourth, in this case, the kind of services that you will be getting once you are through with your lectures, once you have watched all the lectures. So let me start off with the first one, content. Now we do take pride in having the most research content that is there, most research content taken from ICA, taken from many other uh, new kind of books that are emerging in the market based upon the new industries which are opening, say the e-commerce sector or say the cryptocurrencies, all those things. Somewhere in our discussion, we try to touch upon all the new kind of businesses that are there. For providing the most exhaustive content, we are going to be giving you all five books. Five books, book one practical book, book two your workbook, book three your case study and theory book, book four your case study digest book and book five in this case will be blast from the past that is accumulation of the past papers. Let me take you through all these books that I just now mentioned. This is the first of the five books that you are going to be getting. This book I call as practical book, it will be taking around 200 hours to be completing this entire book. It has all the questions that are relevant for your exams. Apart from that, all the new questions that keep on coming in, in the examinations are all incorporated right over here only. After the preface and few of the tips, one thing that I have done over here is that I have put something called, I call that as point zero. What is point zero? It is all the terms that you all should be knowing whenever you are going to be doing business because this subject is all about how to run your business in a perfect way. So therefore, you know, there are good chances that you're going to be succeeding. So in future, if you want to be a CFO of a company, if you want to be CEO of a company, if you want to be having your own startup, you'll be getting all the directions from this particular subject, what should be done. So all the terms, but I've left it open because new, new terms are coming, new, new kind of businesses are coming. So any new types of businesses, any new types of terms will be all put over here and then in this case we start away with our chapters. Now in chapters I have an introductory uh, kind of a chapter for each and everything that we have to be doing and towards the end like once we have solved all the questions I do have a summary of all the concepts that we all have learned as you all can see on your left hand side right now this particular table. Then in that case once a chapter is over <coughs> then in that case one thing more that we all have done for each and every question I've given a suitable kind of a heading over here. So therefore in case you want to be searching like you know for any specific type of a question towards the end all these headings will guide you all fast towards the sum that you all are looking for. Okay. Now this is our first of the practical book. Now this practical book already includes many case studies that includes like you know uh, the case studies that includes the calculations up and so on. So many types of questions that can be asked in exams, the numerical ones as well as the theory ones are included over here. This is our first the book. This is our second book that complements our first book actually. So I want to be solving maximum number of questions for you during the time that you're going to be watching these lectures. So therefore for that only, for that objective only what I have done. All the questions, wherever there are comments, there are graphs, there are many things that I want to be telling you all, but then I don't want to be wasting time in making you all write for those things are all pre-printed over here. So therefore some empty graphs have also been kept over here. So therefore like, you know, you all can try uh, to complete maximum number of questions in the limited amount of time that you all have. Towards the end of this particular book, I have also kept a kind of your progress report whereby what you all should try to be doing whenever you are revising the chapters for the first time, second time, third time and then towards your exam also, last day revision also. I have kept all the things 
that you all require till the end of the things. This is our second book that is our workbook that complements our practical book. This is going to be your third book that is case study and theory book. These includes all the case studies that are there in your module plus few extra that have been asked in exams. Your complete theory coverage each and everything. Now this book starts away with the master index. This master in, uh, index will include all the theory questions along with the page numbers. Apart from that each and every case study belongs to which particular sector all those particular things are written over here. So therefore towards the end if you ever try to be thinking sir I wanted to see the case study on the restaurant business and all those things you will be able to spot very fast from this kind of index. Now apart from that once your theory starts everything has been arranged in a manner whereby it is a question and an answer form because in exams it will be more or less like that only. All the questions that are there, we have the answers in simplified form, not the language of the institute. But then this language will help you to recall whatever you all have done. Apart from that, wherever some jargons are possible to help you all to remember all those things I have done. First we have the chapter, the entire theory and then we have the case studies which belong to that particular chapter. This will ensure that whatever is there in a module, all those particular things are covered up right in this particular book. You are going to be getting a lecture on each and every theoretical question, each and every case study also. Now this is going to be a third book, case study digest book. Around in the month of Feb 2021, I say launch a new book called as case study digest book. It included many new case studies, many new case scenarios. Apart from that, it included skill assessment questions. Skill assessment means your practical questions here. Okay. So, I have a compilation of all those particular questions over here. Again, in beginning, there is a master index that tells you each and every case study revolves around which industry up and so on. All those particular things are still there in this book also. I have kept the order of this book exactly same as that of the institute. Although answers I have tried to simplify based upon how you all should be thinking, not based upon how uh, IC has presented them. One question that many people ask, is it necessary to write on the language of the institute? Absolutely no. This is business, okay, and everybody thinks business in a different way. So therefore, like, you know, when you all do your SCMP, we always try to be saying this particular thing. Keep your minds open. Read a lot about the businesses that are emerging now. And every business is different. So therefore, you will be seeing all those particular things over here also. Case studies are big questions. Case scenarios are smaller versions of the case study. And skill assessment are your practical questions. So all those things you will find over here. Now, in your actual delivery, you either might get a separate book for case study and theory and separate book for case study digest or you might be getting a combined book. Okay, This is our case study digest book. This is our last book. I call this as blast from the past as a compilation of the past papers of the institute. Over here, till now, whatever papers have happened, all those particular things you are going to be getting over here. Okay, each and every question paper fully solved. We spend around four to five hours on solving each and every paper because I do a lot of discussions also. Now, what is so special in this particular book? Now, I've kept the questions separate, the answers separate because in case you want to be trying up the questions yourself, then you should be having a separate uh, question paper. Once the question papers are done, then in that case, you have your answer papers. Now. What I have done, so therefore you exactly will be coming to know that how you should try to attempt the paper. After each and every question over here, I have written estimated time that you all should take to be solving each and every question that is there. All those things you all can see over here, like question number one should be taking this much to this much time, question number two should be taking this much and this much time. So I have written the minimum time, I have written the maximum time that you all should be taking whenever you are personally trying to be solving the question paper. Now this will help you for your time management. Now once the questions are over and then I have to give you all the suggested answers. First of all answers are as always made by me not copied by the institute. Wherever I say answer is perfect all those things have been copied but as such wherever a better way of presentation is there simplified ways there, better simple language is there, all those things have been done. In beginning you also have a mini index for each and every answer paper that tells you that each question was asked from which particular chapter, apart from that the name of that chapter again the minimum and the maximum time have again be printed over here. So once you solve you can always try to watch our lecture on that particular paper and try to see like you know that whether you were good in that or not. So solving all these papers will help you to reach your goal of getting 80 to 19 is in SMP faster. Now after the content, our second part is all about fees. Now fees, we all have multiple options. 
Now these options they differ based upon the validity and the number of views that you will be getting with each and every lecture. Mind you the content is going to be same but the validity and the number of times that you all can view each and every lecture will be different. So therefore in case your paying capacity is not very high we all have tried to be taking care of that part also in form of a lower fees but with lower validity and lower number of views. Now uh, <coughs> the content will be same as I told before and every student will be getting lifetime updates irrespective of the fees that you all pay. Coming over to the track record of the results. Now honestly it depends upon the students how they all perform. But in case ever you think that the results do prove the credibility of the teachers also. Then in that case we have in past got AIR1, AIR3, AIR4, AIR4, AIR5 and many other rank holders from AIR6 to AIR50 each and every year. We produce one of the best results in Mumbai and across India for SCMPE. Most of the students when it comes to lectures in SCMPE they all prefer us because of the content that is there. So that is all about our results. What about the services that you all will be getting once you are through with your syllabus or in this case once you are watching. So first most important doubt solving. Doubt solving will be done through our telegram channel. If you have a doubt, then in that case, our telegram ID is at the rate AJ next. You post your doubt over there and I will be replying to those particular doubts within 24 hours. And moreover, in case like, you know, your doubt is a super one, something that I have not got before, then in that case, I try to make a video out of it and post that on YouTube also. Now, uh, that's this particular point or what services you're going to be getting. Now, one other thing also, I had to talk about it uh, towards the end, but I'll tell you all right now also. SMP is a subject which under the new course has been continuously changing. New case studies have been keep on coming and each and every year I say has tried to be putting something new apart from the modules also. And obviously new RTPs will keep on coming each and every year, twice in a year. New question papers of ICA will also be coming again twice in a year. All those things will be addressed how all these things will be addressed through our lifetime updates that you're going to be getting through your age and app. Now, uh, <clears throat> that's it about like, you know, that what all we all do. Apart from that, this course is suitable for whom? This course is suitable for a fresher student who has minimum six months pending for his exams because you will be requiring approximately three to four months to be watching this entire course. It's around of 300 hours here. So therefore it is a very exhaustive course. You'll require around three months to be watching this complete course provided you all watch around three hours on a daily basis. So that is one thing. Okay. It's only suitable for those particular students like, you know, who have minimum six months for your exams. In case you do not have, then I will rather recommend that you go for our other product that is Crash Course Plus that is approximately of 150 hours. Now, uh, I've told you all about the books. I've told you all about the lifetime updates also. And towards the end, would like to be saying that this 300 hours course, I'm going to be revising for you completely in around 30 to 35 hours, whereby each and every question that we all do, each and every question, we are going to be having a summary of that, which will be given to you all. Apart from that, there'll be ranking of each and every question, rank one, rank two, rank three, rank three being the most important. So therefore, towards the end, in case you want to be revising your practical book completely, completely, then in that case, it will help you to do all those things very fast. And more or less, your revision lectures will also be useful that once you have finished off a certain topic, then you can watch the revision lectures of that. Everything that you will have done before will start to become. Now, these revision lectures are accompanied, are accompanied by revisionary notes also, which will be given to you all. Okay, now... Uh, that's it. Do take advantage of this. We work very hard when it comes to the content. We are not very good in the marketing part. We are not very good in trying to tell to the students like, you know, that you all should join us. But our content speaks volumes about us. Okay, so the, all the best. In case you will have any more queries, you can write to us on our Telegram ID that goes by the name of Adderate AJ Next. Or you can always call us on 8080324444. Or in this case, you all uh, can send us a WhatsApp also on this particular number. We all will respond. Our website link is www.ajnext.com for taking any admissions online. Okay, thank you guys. Uh, all the best for all your endeavors in present and in future. Bye guys, thank you.